what's up, you guys? This is Ninja XTX, and I'm back to share another video with, video with you guys. This is part 16 in my chairbound prepper series. Um, for the past couple weeks, I've been discussing um, how to maintain our mobility and how to find alternative ways of transportation. I'm going to continue with that in number in this one, which is number 16, um, or part 16, if you will. My being differently abled, our uh, mobility has to be combat ready. Um, and our transportation has to be combat ready. Um, and I may be putting myself out there a lot by admitting this. Now, those of you that see my wheelchair think it's a regular wheelchair. Ladies and gentlemen, no. This chair has been modified slightly because I'm still working on it. This chair has been modified for light combat. Um, what I mean by that is I have weapons hitting all around this chair. Y'all may not see them, but trust and believe I do have them. And if you do see them, well, it's too late for you. Um, some of the, now I'm going to disclose some of the weapons I have on there. I'm not going to disclose all of them. Um, I actually have a combat knife. Hidden in the arm wrist, like so, or hidden on the arm wrist. Um, I have a pair of Filipino fighting sticks hidden in the seat of the chair beside me, so that if anything jumps off, I can automatically. Take care of that with my sticks or my combat knife. Um, I also have. <laughs> I know I don't think I'm gonna tell that one. Um, I have. Throwing stars strapped. Mm. Yeah, I'm able to tell that. I have throwing stars or shurikens strapped to the bottom of the footrest. But they do not come out unless I hit a button on the side of the chair. Now, do they come out and, and fly around? No. They come out as. if you would, um, blades to slice anyone that gets in my way if need be, but that is only for extreme emergencies and whatnot. Um, I have a few other things in the, on this chair that I'm not going to get into because Number one, it's a breach of my security. Number two, uh, I don't want to, as my uncle used to say, you don't show all your cards at, until the end of a poker game, and even then, you still hold something back. So, I'm going to do that. 
All I'm going to say is if you, if you come in here or if you come around me and you mean me harm, God be with you. Um, my advice to other chairbound people that may be watching this is think outside the box. Think what you can use on your chair as a weapon if need be, and think about different ways to modify your uh, chair so it is combat ready. Um, that's the end of this video. Please take care of yourselves and each other. One world, one love. If you have any questions, comments, or requests, please send them to my YouTube account, or if you know how to get this from me on Facebook, please send them to my Facebook account. Thank y'all. Love y'all.